Um, I cannot believe that Miss Canning has six kids. She could use some of these hacks I'm about to talk about. Oh, good. Tell me. I mean, how do you even, what do I you drive no with six kids? Uh, do you have a passenger van? That's a very good point. Those of you watching that have six children, how Tell did you us. get everybody around? Yeah. That is a, I, logistically, I just wonder how that happens. That's a very good question. Mm -hmm. Are you going to have to get a new car? Didn't you think I hope not. Or do you have a one, two, three? Yeah, you're good. I don't know. My car is paid off, so I really don't want to do yeah, that. Yeah, you're like, I'm good. <laughs> I am so, so good. We'll see, yes. All right, so we okay. talk. I thought we're like a, like Emily Foley was coming back for a beauty segment. Oh, but lo and behold, it's my, my yes. beauty expert, Kara Kinney. Yes. Well, this is kind of some beauty hacks because the headline caught my eye because it said lazy beauty hacks, and I was like, that's right up my alley because I spend about a total of two minutes on this when I'm not here. Probably you about five not. minutes you on this beautiful. today. Stop. But um, some of these things I agreed with and some of them I don't. Some of them are wardrobe staples okay. that everybody should have, this author says. Got okay, it. another list from BuzzFeed. The first one is a cow neck top. I don't really love a cow neck, but if you do, great. Um, the picture they showed is this beautiful woman right here. I do like the cow neck like satin thing she has going oh, on Oh yeah. Here, but they say this is definitely something that every woman should have in her closet because you can dress it up or dress it down very easily and you're kind of pulled together in a matter of minutes. Uh, I don't think I have anything. I have, I have mm -hmm. uh, silky black tanks, but nothing sure. with a cow neck, I don't think. Now I was thinking cow neck like long sleeve in the winter. Oh right, right. I do have some sweater, fitted sweaters, but yeah, but then sometimes they drape funny. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not like a huge fan. I'm always worried like I'm going to get a crumb stuck in it, to be honest. Well, you're gonna, well, you might have some food. If I get a crumb stuck in there, that would be me, and I'd be so embarrassed. It'll it's like be a loaf fine. of bread. Yeah, right. Oh, then you'll have to kind of go, yes. excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah, I don't know if that one's for me. Okay. The next one is, and this one is definitely for you because I know you have a lot of these, I but printed scarves. Ahead. Yes. Yeah, so the way they use this in the article is tie it to a purse to freshen up your purse, or if you need to have a ponytail day, they look great in ponytails, and people don't really do that that much. I was just telling Calvin, My Calvin uh -huh. Myers, you weren't uh -huh. here. Yes. Uh, we were talking about Calvin's segment coming up next week, and uh -huh. I was we were kind of brainstorming sure. what are women in the summer beauty like? What what do we want to do? Effortless but still look fresh right. as we're going to the pool. And exactly. I was saying I saw a woman walking around with that beautiful scarf yes. ponytail and I thought I'm gonna I'm gonna bring that back to my life. I do. Because it looks so chic and elegant. And you have a lot of chic elegant scarves that need to be pulled out of your closet, Miss Christine. Okay, I will do it. Like an Hermes scarf she has. I know. Just well I've got two. Around. One two, two both they both me. were gifts. One from two. Yeah. One was my mother's and one was a, yes. um, a gentleman I was dating. <laughs> Thank you. Back in the 90s. Thank you. It's very it's my, sweet. Well, they never go out of style. No, they don't. Yeah. No, they put don't. that on a purse or in your hair. Yes. Okay, the next one is, I happen to be wearing them today, mm. um, but cork platform sandals. I prefer an espadrille, but these were what I have on right now. But um, they're slightly more dressy than flats, yes. but they're not like, you know, your stilettos. Oh, those are cute. Very cute, comfortable, very in style now. They say everyone should have a pair of these in their closet. Right. Elevates your wardrobe. Producer Haley's wearing some She today. does. I love those that she has yes. today, actually. Really, really cute. Mm -hmm. That's good. Now, I will say, it happened mm -hmm. practically the day I hit 50. Okay. I, I, as soon as I get off this show, I'm, you know I change into my right. flats and flip-flops. I do the same. And I have great cork heels like that. I mm -hmm. just don't feel as comfortable wearing them. Is it just because my knee injury or because I'm older? <laughs> I don't know. No, I think that you are so used to wearing stilettos. See, I never was a stiletto girl oh. because I'm very clumsy. So, so I never really wore high heels all that much. So but if I had you to. did, you wore those? Yes. Maybe. Got it. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. I'm going to so break mine out. Invest in those. They're I'll also not that tomorrow. expensive, too. Um, this next one is another wardrobe staple, and these never go out of style. You can buy them for $2.99 all the way. You can spend a lot of money. I know a brand that you really like. It's a local company. Yes. But a good V-neck tee. So everyone should have a V-neck tee in their closet because they're just buttery and soft, and you can pair them with anything. You can dress them up. You can dress them down with jewelry. You can put a pretty statement necklace on with it. Yes, I love a good, good. soft tee. And mm -hmm. by the way, did you hear? I read once that Jennifer Aniston gets her tees taken in. Of course she of does. Of course she does. Of because guess what? Does. If you really like something enough, mm -hmm. and it's the right um, you know, fabric, right. the way the V hits you perfectly, why not? I mean, right. To me, I'd be like, well, that might be a waste sure. of $15, $20, but not if, if right. it makes you feel better about wearing it. I remember in the late 90s, there was a picture of her crossing the street in a white tank, orange pants, and flip-flops, and it said, 
How much do you think it costs to look this casual? And her outfit was worth like $1,800. Something, something crazy, <laughs> yeah. We don't, <laughs> so, yeah. I don't do that. Okay, yeah, yeah it uh, costs a lot apparently, but yes, she looks good. But she, she looked, at, well nowadays mm. we have sure. the Zara's and these other great yes. solutions for finding uh, things that are on right. trend. Um, and they don't have to break the bank, so I love that. My issue is, if you have a tip on this, how do you wash really nice t-shirts without them getting holes in them? I always feel like I, I have a t-shirt that I really like, and it's that stencil or like a lycra blend, and I get little holes all over them. You get holes? <laughs> I gotta, I gotta, I don't know. I gotta look at your washer. <laughs> okay. um, but that is a good question. I, I try not I to know. throw them in the dryer, but that's hard to catch when right. everything's kind of balled mm -hmm, up. Mm -hmm. Okay, these are good. Okay, this next one I'm obsessed with. I haven't tried this yet. But if you are a gal who doesn't like waiting for your nails to dry or even mm -hmm. going to the nail salon, there is this new thing and Tanya Sam of Real Housewives of Atlanta wears these all the time and her nails always look impeccable. But adhesive nail polish. So you like just the peel Sally press Hansen? Like, yes, what? but it's reinvigorated for the year 2019. These are just like press on nails essentially, but she's she always will have the most immaculate nails and when I compliment her, she's like, they're press on, they're press on. And she could yes. afford more, yeah. but she chooses not well, to. Well, she said the same thing. Yes. She was like, I don't like I don't the sitting. Yeah. I don't either. Mm -hmm. And then, um, oh, whatever, I just, I need to take care of my hands. No, um, these just, are great tips and advice. Like we'll post that. them. We'll have Trent post them. There are a lot more them. online. Oh, yes. good.